Hello everybody. Uh, today, I figured I'd actually try something kind of different. And yeah, I know that Melty Blood has a large presence on this channel as of right now, and that's mostly because, well, uh, I like Melty Blood. And for those, you get, for those of you who have seen the first episode of Into the Nebula, you guys will notice that, uh, you know, I was doing a live gameplay thing of White Lens Arcade Mode. I figured, why not do that again, but where I'm actually focusing on the game instead of just talking. So, uh, there, there's going to be some light commentary, you know, throughout this, you know. But, uh, yeah, this time I'm actually going to be trying. Yep. Okay, here we go. First things first, we have, apparently have to fight blood. So, here we go. Keep in mind, I've honestly never gotten a place with Kahime. I really, really hope the Switch version, you know, comes to America. But, yeah. Easy enough. Yeah, again, this may not be the most uh, enthralling Whiteland gameplay, but yeah. yeah. Next up, Sion. I still find it funny how this character is also on uh, Undernight, which is another game that will be eventually appearing on this channel. So, that's going to be fun. Ow. Got 
Got her. Mix up. I need to remember that White Lead has other attacks other than my usual Unga Bunga combo. But, uh, yeah, for those of you guys watching, I hope you guys are having a great day. Ow. I bet she has that. <laughs> Not quite what I was trying to go for there, but it, well. Coma. Funny story about Coma is that um, one of my best friends, who's yet to actually bring into podcasts, um, but he mains Coma, and he's he's gotten really good at the game already. It's kind of terrifying in all honesty. He's one of my FGC friends. I guess he doesn't. Well, he claims not. Be, he claims not be really an FGC, but he's the guy who got me into Blaze. Or I think actually, yeah, I think he was the guy who got me into uh, uh, Blaze Blue. Um. It was one of, the, one of the first people who told me about Guilty Gear. Pandem, who you guys know from uh, the channel, you know, or you know, like he's mentioned quite often. But um, uh, Pandem, um, you know, he's he's the guy who got me into Guilty Gear. Uh, what was I going with this? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, the um, Pandem and the other guy I was talking about, they're they're two different people. Both trying to go there for there. Sorry, again, I kind of zoned out focusing, but, yeah, um, for, for those of you guys who don't know, again, you know, um, I'm a very, very big fighting game nut, pretty much almost at this point. Okay, give me a second, I need to actually focus. Oh no! <laughs> I still went to my car crap. Bunk. Oh, yeah, that one came kind of close. But anyways, um, so I was talking about this pandem and the other guy are two different people, but uh, they have both got me into two separate fighting games. Guilty Gear, er, yeah. Pandem got me into Guilty Gear. My other friend got me into Under Night, so. Yeah. Oh, right, who's up next? Oh, no. Yeah, I'm going to have to go completely quiet again. Sorry, guys, because i got to focus here. Versus Michael Roa. Actually, I think it's just Michael. Michael Roa Valdemajong. However you pronounce that, I probably just butchered that. Versus Roa.
Finding out that, um, Whiteland was a succubus, is a succubus, still caught me off guard. No, this isn't good. Got him. Whew. Yeah, I don't know why, but I always seem to have trouble with this dude in particular. Got him. Oh my! Okay, when I got him, that was actually rather freaking fancy. <laughs> yep. So, I hope you all are really, really enjoying the gameplay so far. I know that, uh, you know, my commentary is uh, probably not the best, but. You know, I'm hoping I'm making up for it at least with my gameplay. Oh, hey, look, it's Hisui. This will be interesting. Ah, I'm having trouble actually hitting an L. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I finally suffered my first kale this entire run. Uh, so much for getting... Ow. Got her. Ah, oh, that one came a little bit too close to comfort there.
that was a comeback for the century. Jesus. <sighs> okay. Sorry about that. I can't believe I actually lost a round. But, well. Win some, you lose some. Next up, Rispas Strasberg. Ow. Not what I meant to do, game. Did, did she have shield pops? Oh god, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Excuse me, what? Oh, wait, I'm still alive. Ah, I almost made a comeback. That would have been freaking awesome to have on recording. Got her. <laughs> oh, sorry, I just got I just got an achievement out of that too. Oh, that actually felt good. <laughs> Ow. What? Got him. Got him. Oh boy, here's a fun fight.
Yeah, I can't read these two. Ow. Sorry about that, I'm like focusing actually kind of hard here, just trying to beat him. On arcade mode, Nanya always gives me the uh, biggest challenge for some reason. So, like, at the actual arcade, we have... There's an arcade where, near where I live that actually has this game, so... <laughs> on the podcast this one tripped me up so bad because I wasn't expecting it <laughs> it's always cursed to see this character but hey it's freaking Neko arc what do you expect This, this fight still caught me off guard, and actually saying Nekoark's full moveset, it's just, what? <laughs> so you guys are gonna be hearing me laugh a lot during this fight, because, uh, it's freaking Nekoark. Get over here! I really, really, really love how just Nekoark is just suddenly here. Ooh, hell, oh, there we go. Oh, I didn't even realize that could be an attack. That's kind of scary to know, actually. Oh, here we go. Ow. What even is, uh... <laughs> what even is our hitbox? Jeez! Cat. Ah! What? How? <laughs> I can't even complain when fighting this boss because it's just so freaking ridiculous. I love it. I guess what? Guess what? Guess what? 
Wrong attack, but you get the idea. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Got her. Ah, neck orc, jeez. Why are you a thing? I mean, I know why you're a thing and you're great, but come on. Well, there we go. So I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, run of uh, Melty Blood. Actress again, current code to White Len Arcade Run. Uh, yeah, I, I know that my commentary isn't exactly the greatest, especially considering again I can be kind of scatterbrained when I'm trying to focus while I'm, you know, doing commentary. But uh, I really hope you all enjoyed this. Uh, there was going to be an Emma video today, but I'm actually going to put that um, off a bit. Just because, well, I'm still trying to, you know, I'm, I'm working with the uh, stuff, like, you know, the portrait arts and everything, trying to improve it a bit, you know. Trying to make the videos a little bit better quality. As well as OBS is kind of confusing to work with whenever it comes to RPG Maker for some reason. But, uh, yeah. So this is the, um, the, uh, the White Lion Arcade Run. And I really, really hope that you all like this. And let me know in the comments down below if you guys want more of this. You know, like more of these are like little, um, fighting game arcade runs. And, uh, if so, if, you know, if this video performs well, you know, I, I might just do more of these in the future. This is just something I wanted to try. You know, because I've already done the arcade run in the uh, podcast. I figured that why not you just do an actual commentary run of it. Even though it was mostly just more gameplay. But, uh, yeah. Hope to see you guys again another time. See ya.